Hey everyone, I'd like you to meet Jake. A lot of people may not have seen an American turkey alive before, but this is Jake. Isn't he handsome? He is a rescued turkey. He came to us from a local organization called Red Dog Farm, and they found him um, by someone on the side of the road, like a sideshow, side street carnival, and Jake was barely alive. He barely moved for two weeks and ate. As Thanksgiving comes up, I wanted you to meet Jake because Jake, while he's not one of the factory farm turkeys, could have easily have had a horrible life like they do. Jake is very sweet and he's very loyal. He actually came to us because he was in love with a female turkey that had fallen in love with another bird. So he's very sad. Um, but now he gets to take care of our two girls, Meg, who's the nutmeg, the nutmeg brown bar, um, <clears throat> Rhode Island red chicken, and Gertie, who's a bar rocks. And after our rooster Napoleon, and all three of them also were rescues from Red Duck Farm, after Napoleon was killed, the girls were also very sad. They were scared and didn't come out of their coop for a couple of days. But now they're, you know, back out and they've got Jake to look out for them. And Jake is a very handsome boy. Uh, he's got beautiful feathers. He just had his fall molt. Some of his feather went to P.S. I Made This and to Mary at Pretty Good Things to make some beautiful things with. So they were just compassionately um, gathered up naturally shed feathers. <clears throat> but now he has his full feathers back. He's got a sweet head and actually what's kind of funny is his head is very warm. Um, it actually is also a gauge for their moods. So the little waddle that's down the snood that's down in the front of their beaks kind of tell how they <clears throat> are feeling. When he's nervous or actually calm it retracts all the way up and his the blood flow to his head and neck kind of diminishes. Um, he also makes like a cool kind of, his sounds go from chirping to a deep booming in his chest depending on who he's talking to or about. And he <clears throat> has very nice strong legs so it's very fun to see him walking across the yard with his big strong legs. But most turkeys don't have as good of a life, so I hope this Thanksgiving you'll consider celebrating by adopting a turkey from Farm Sanctuary or, and or, you know, not having a big dead killed turkey or ham, you know, or pheasant or whatever animal you're going to put on your table. Have, you know, donate it to a sanctuary instead and that'll be a really great Thanksgiving. So, from Jake, say hey Jakey Jake, and from the girls, have a great Thanksgiving. Bye.